the freedom challenge in the EU is real, is crucial. And it's not something that is going to be solved by market dynamics per se, and it's not something that is going to be solved by technological developments. Uh, we cannot overcome media freedom challenges with a new or better algorithm or uh, more AI tools for journalists. We need more. Uh, and media freedom is at the foundation of the EU project, of its value. It has a huge uh, role in the EU Charter of Fundamental Rights. Uh, so, as such, it needs, as a challenge, it needs to be taken seriously. It needs an, uh, a complex uh, response and harmonized across the member states. Um, in fact, no solution will work if each member state acts independently and goes in slightly different direct directions or very different directions. It won't work for democracy and it won't work, work for the economy either. Uh, because fragmented responses won't lead, will lead definitely to fragmented markets. So it's not only the European democracy, which is at risk, but it's also the European internal market projects um, and the European society. Uh, I think this is the key way to look at what we want to achieve with the Media Freedom Act. If we stick on this key way, then how the rules need to be shaped is going to be an easier task. Not an easy task, but an easier task.